Hi everyone, my name is Abel Gray Kantoma. I'm from Greatest Card Design Concept. He's actually my WhatsApp contact. You can reach me on this number or you can even call me, okay? Uh, these are the list of softwares which we've covered on our YouTube channel. And all these softwares are very much available on our Telegram platform where we teach people how to come about their designs from the start until you attain mastery, okay? For 30 days, okay, at an amazing price, okay? very very much affordable we'll teach you all of these softwares we'll give you the softwares guide you on how to install and crack them and then train you through the process until you attain mastery okay today i'm going to be showing you how to design a roundabout on your seaworld 3d okay um amazing right okay on civil 3d 2018 uh you have uh, a template already for roundabout where all you do is just to specify the your dimensions and some other little changes that you make and then you get your perfect roundabout okay just the way you want it okay let's jump right into it okay now as you can see this is actually a sample of what uh, you can actually achieve with your civil 3d okay uh, right now I'm going to take this off completely okay um, if you come here all you need to do is just to create a single line you can create a line you can create another cross like this okay come to line create another okay you go to alignment and then create alignment from object okay this is an object i'll click uh, it says press enter to accept alignment so um if you want this direction you can see this is the direction it's going i can leave it at that direction if i don't want that i can change it okay and then i'm going to click on ok and i'll take that uh, create another alignment create uh, from object I'll click on this and I click I can reverse this if I don't want it in this direction okay okay and then you can rename this here okay uh, let me make this one okay the next thing here I'm going to do I'll go to intersection I'll go to create a roundabout now um, you can see this is the minimum this is the maximum your inscribed cycle diameter you can actually change that your center line uh, your center island diameter you can actually change all of this um, here this is your draw style you can change this to suit what you want um, here you can see we come back here you can see we have different kinds of uh, roundabout the generic roundabout the Italian junction design okay all of these you can make any choice that you want I'm going to actually leave it at this and I'll click on ok and then I'll click on ok here and now here you see it tells you that select the location of the center of the new roundabout I want it at the middle and then it says I should select the line defining the new road center. I'll click on this. Now the lane width, okay? I can leave it at 3.5. I can leave this for approaching. This is for departing, okay? And I can actually leave all of that at 3.5. I can select here to be another lane. I can select here as well. I can select here as well. Okay? now you have your roundabout but we can make some other changes to this all you need to do is just to highlight this just select we go to roundabout properties now if i come here whatever i do here you see it reflecting here okay it is very very much interactive if you come to general you can see here the roundabout name i can name it whatever i want uh the name of uh, the location i can give it a name i can change that here i can decide to change that name roundabout type okay 
uh, the ID if I've done so many other roundabouts I can make okay based on uh, I want to easily uh, identify okay I can number them okay and then uh, remember here this is the standard used this is what we are actually using here okay um, standard arrows okay I can decide to use an arrow that looks like this it's a bit stylish uh, compared to this I can decide to maintain this if I want come back to your preference okay we can align our names to the arms okay uh, these are our arms okay we have the north uh, the south okay we have the east and then the west okay okay come here to run there you can come to your dimension you can change the dimensions of your apron the dimension of your you can change the width the apron the apron diameter um, this accurately lean how many you want uh, you can change all of you can make it even up to four you can see here okay so and then your crown line you can see your grade level you can design you can use the user defined elevation okay okay uh, this is now you know we have two alignment um, that we created one like this and the other like this okay uh, we have the north to south and then we have the east west okay uh, this is the first uh, alignment uh, this is the second alignment this is your first arm sorry this is your arm one this is your arm two okay at your approach you can your design speed okay uh, at what uh, kilometer per hour we can design it to that way okay your design speed uh, your entry uh, your exit all of this can be changed you can change them to your taste okay you can click on crosswalk just in case you want to actually edit that okay Now you can see the diagram here is actually showing okay you can see um, from here you can do all of that editing here you can see your rumble strip your sleep uh, your speed strip uh, your speed uh, stripping you can turn off this diagram you can turn it on just the way I did right now you can turn uh, arrows your turn arrows you can change uh, the way it looks you can see different type here so it's very actually very very flexible you can see you can work with it just the way you want it to look like you can see your entry width okay your approach width okay minimum approach all of these can be edited to your taste okay you can edit them to your taste your sleep entry and all that okay your alignment your approach this is we just done with the first alignment okay this is the second arm okay this is your first arm this is the second arm okay remember we said we have north south east west okay so that is how it is and then the approach here okay it's showing you the other side of the arm okay crosswalk and all of this just like the way we did in the first arm it's actually the same okay when you come to you can see this is for the north this is for the north this is for the south okay that is 
we just finish that of the east and then the west okay uh, okay we'll come to the fastest part speed you can edit all of this these are all drop down menus you can drop them down and do all of those editing there they are very much easy you can see it's very very interactive you can see the diagram here all are all shown you can do all of this uh, edit whatever you want to edit you can see it from this or that from the diagram here you can see all of this uh, signature you can actually turn them off if you don't want you can clear you can as well select all okay or you clear them all or you select all it will apply all the signal you want all the signs everything you should like your road marks as well uh, you can turn them off as well if you don't want them to be shown uh, you can select them all and apply so if I clear them for example now and I apply allow it to load it will take effect on the original design there okay I can select them all and then I apply okay um, that is that if you already love what you have seen uh, why not give it a thumbs up subscribe to this channel is actually free click on the bell icon so as to get a notification whenever I post videos I post videos like this on the weekly sometimes on the daily so as to encourage as many that want to have a deeper insight of design okay on my next video I'm going to be showing you guys how to actually do a practical design I'm going to take a real project and do the design for you using survey data and I'm going to run the design for you completely and you're going to see practically how you can actually do your design but this is a sample you can actually follow this step if you already have a picture of what how you want your roundabout to be like all you just need to do is just to input all your values here and it give you your perfect design just the way you want it to be make sure that you stay safe and you stay blessed okay thank you